Hi friends, welcome to my channel NM Lynn McCord says with Nagmani. Today I am going to solve a problem on eigenvalues and eigenvectors and I will give some tips during solving this problem. So don't skip the video and watch till the end. If you have any doubt, please comment below and please continue and the video. See this problem, this is also upper triangular problem. Uh, we will see how to find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors for given matrix. Okay, first for finding eigenvalues, we have to write characteristic equation that is a minus modulus of a minus lambda i which is equal to 0. This is the character characteristic equation for the given matrix. Okay, here a matrix is 1, 2, 3, 0, minus 2, 6, 0, 0, minus 3 and minus lambda into i is need nothing but identity matrix 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 which is equal to 0 okay here so modulus of this one no? and here a minus lambda i so 1 minus lambda into 1 1 so 2 3 0 here minus 2 minus lambda and here 6 0 0 minus 3 minus lambda which is equal to 0 sorry equal to 0 okay here 1 minus lambda into minus 2 minus lambda into minus 3 minus lambda minus 0 into 6 0 minus 2 into here 0 into something 0 minus if you close this row and this column we get 0 into something 0 minus 0 into 6 0 plus 3 into here if you close this column and this row we will get 0 into 0 0 minus 0 into something 0 ok ok which is equal to 0 if you calculate this here 1 minus lambda into this one so 1 minus lambda into minus 2 minus lambda minus 3 minus lambda 1 minus lambda into 0, 0. So here minus 2 into 0 minus 0 is 0. So 0 into something 0. 0 minus 0, 0. 0 into something 0. So this two times get cancelled. So here we this thing is remaining. So from this here we can write that lambda equal to here we can take minus common. Here also minus common. So here 1 minus minus. So minus into minus plus. So we can write this equation as 1 minus lambda into if you take minus common then 2 plus lambda here 3 plus lambda which is equal to 0. From this equation we can write lambda equal to 1 lambda equal to minus 2 here lambda equal to minus 3. These are the eigenvalues for a given matrix. And if I want to say one trick that here, here this is the upper triangular matrix now. So for a upper triangular matrix or lower triangular matrix or a diagonal matrix, for any upper triangular or lower triangular or a diagonal matrix, for these three matrices, the eigenvalues are the whatever the principal diagonal elements are there that are the eigenvalues so here 1 minus 2 minus 3 are the principal diagonal elements these are the eigenvalues for the given matrix these if you see the these are the uh, this is one of the property for the eigenvalues and eigenvectors so this is the upper triangular for this the principal diagonal elements are the eigenvalues for the upper triangular matrix so 1 minus 2 minus 3 so we also got lambda equal to 1 minus 2 minus 3 from this we can verify that whether we got the correct eigenvalues or not okay 
Next we have to find the eigenvectors. Now here I wrote the given matrix A and the eigenvalues. And from here we know that the eigenvalues are 1, minus 2, minus 3. So for a eigenvalue lambda equal to 1, we have to find the eigenvectors. We know the equation for the equation to find the eigenvector that is a minus lambda i into x bar which is equal to 0. So here a is the this matrix. So I am directly writing a minus lambda i matrix here. Okay. See 1 minus lambda 2 3. So here 0 minus 2 minus lambda here 6 0 0 minus 3 minus lambda so identity matrix means only the diagonal elements are present now so directly we only diagonal elements will be changed and other uh, things uh, numbers will be same so i am writing like this and here x bar is the x y z we can assume like that x1, x2, x3 also. So now I am here assuming x, y, z as the x bar vector. Okay. From this equation here we know that lambda equal to 1. After substituting uh, lambda equal to 1 we will see. Okay. Here 1 minus 1 0, 2, 3. So 0 minus 2 minus 1 minus 3. 6, 0, 0 minus 3 minus 1 minus 4 okay into x y z which is equal to 0 from here we can write that 2 x into 0 0 plus 2 y plus 3 z which is equal to 0 this is the one equation we got and also here 0 into x 0 minus 3 y plus 6z which is equal to 0 and x into 0 0 0 into y 0 and minus 4z equal to 0 so from this equation we got the z equal to 0 by substituting z equal to 0 into this equation we get any one of these equation we get y equal to 0 and also we don't know the x value now so let we are assuming x equal to k1 okay so we can write the eigenvectors is for the lambda equal to 1 the eigenvector is okay the eigenvector is know that x y z which is equal to k1 y is 0 z is 0 so by taking k1 as common we can write that 1 0 0 this is the eigen vector for the lambda equal to 1 and in comments i am observing that why you are taking uh, k1 k2 k3 like that so i can say that here the eigen values are limited that if you take n by n matrix then the eigen values for this matrix is n possible eigen vectors are po eigen values are possible and there is infinite number of eigen vectors will present for the given single eigen value so that so i am taking k1 here k1 should be 1 2 3 any value so for the uh, lambda equal to 1 eigen value for this eigen value there is infinite number of eigen vectors so based on this k1 value only that eigenvectors will be depend so we can write like this also this is the correct procedure to find the eigenvectors for a given eigen value so for lambda equal to one, we can find the eigenvectors for the lambda equal to minus 2 so same formula here also a minus lambda i into x bar which is equal to 0 so a matrix i wrote here okay a minus lambda into x bar so directly i am writing here so 1 minus lambda minus 2 na? so 1 minus 2 is minus 1 here 2 3 0 minus 2 minus 2 here we get sorry i will write a minus lambda i matrix here so 1 minus lambda 2 2 3 
0 minus 2 minus lambda 6 0 0 minus 3 minus lambda this is the a minus lambda i matrix okay uh, we are uh, now i am substituting minus 2 here so minus into minus plus 2 now so 1 plus 2 is nothing but 3 so sorry 3 and here 2 3 is common and here 0 0 and minus 2 minus of minus plus 2 so minus 2 plus 2 get cancelled 0 and here 6 0 0 here minus 3 minus of minus plus so minus 3 plus 2 we get minus 1 okay x bar is x y z which is equal to 0 hmm? so from here this equation we can write this 3 into x 3x plus 2y plus 3z which is equal to 0 from this equation 0 into x 0 plus 0 into y 0 plus 6 into z 6z so 0 plus 0 plus 6z which is equal to 0 here also 0 into x 0 0 into y 0 minus z 1 into z minus z which is equal to 0 from these two equations we can conclude that z is equal to 0 okay after substituting z equal to 0 in the above equation we get 3x plus 2y equal to 0 so we can assume x or y anything which is equal to so let i am assuming y equal to k2 okay so by substituting y equal to k2 in this equation we get 3x equal to minus 2k2 so from here x equal to minus 2k2 by 3 this is the x value this is the y value and here we got the z value so from these three we can write for uh, lambda equal to minus 2 the eigenvector is minus 2 k2 by 3 y is k2 and z equal to 0 so, so this is the eigenvector by taking k2 as common here we can write that minus 2 by 3 here 1 here 0 if you like uh, if you don't want this 3 as denominator you can uh, take uh, let if you assuming that k2 as 3 then we can get here or we can take 3 common here so here 3 k2 which is equal to 3 k2 into sorry minus 2 here we are multi just multiplying with 3 that's it so here 3 here 3 into 0 0 so we are getting this much this is the eigenvector for a given eigen value okay this is the actual one uh, if we assume that k2 as 3 or um, if let k2 as 3 then 3 into so k2 as 3 then 3 into minus 2 by 3 we will get minus 2 3 into 1 3 so 3 into 0 0 this one is the let k2 equal to 3 then only this eigen vector is possible we can uh, this k2 value be any value from 1 to infinity now i am going to find the eigen vector for lambda equal to minus 3 okay here lambda equal to minus 3 we are substituting in a minus lambda i matrix okay here we get 1 minus of minus plus 1 plus 3 4 2 3 0 minus 2 minus of minus plus minus 2 plus 3 we'll get 1 6 0 0 minus 3 minus of minus plus 3 minus 3 plus 3 which is equal to 0 and here x vector is x y z which is equal to 0 if you want you can compare this is the uh, eigen vector for the lambda equal to minus 2 and here i'm finding eigen vector for lambda equal to minus 3 you can compare so here i am writing so by multiplying these eight vectors equate matrix 4 into x 4x plus 2 into y 2y plus 3 into z 3z which is equal to 0 and here 0 into x 0 
plus 1 into y y plus 6 into z 6z which is equal to 0 here everything is 0 so here nothing is there 0 into x 0 0 into y 0 0 into z 0 which is equal to 0 so nothing this no need of to write this equation so from these e two equations we have two equations three unknowns so let we are assuming any one of value so here we are assuming z equal to k3 okay z equal to k3 by substituting z equal to k3 in this equation we will get y equal to minus 6 k3 okay and we know the a z value and y value we can find x value from this equation so 4x plus 2 into y is nothing but minus k3 plus 3 into z is nothing but k3 which is equal to 0 and now here 4x minus 6 to the 12 k3 plus 3k3 which is equal to 0 4x which is equal to 9k3 from here x equal to 9k3 by 4 okay so we know that x y z values so the eigen vector for the eigen value lambda equal to 3 is x is 9k3 by 4 y is minus 6k3 z is k3 so by taking k3 common from this equation we will get 9 by 4 minus 6 minus 1 this is the eigen vector so let uh, k3 equal to 4 then we get 4 into 9 by 4 is nothing but 9 4 6 uh, 24 minus 24 so 4 into 1 4 this is the Eigen vector for the eigen value lambda equal to minus 3. In this way, we can find the eigen vectors for the eigen values. And one more thing I want to say here I assume let k2 equal to 3 and k3 equal to 4. That is only for understanding purpose. You can try it up to here that lambda equal to minus 2 for this eigen value. The eigen vector is k2 into minus 2 by 3, 1, 0 as the eigen vector. So up to there you can write and uh, if you have any doubt please comment below and this video I am providing for your reference purpose. If you want you can take the screenshot from this video and uh, whatever you have doubts please comment below. I will try to clarify your doubts and if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching. Thank you.